Here on YouTube, you've seen Week in My Coils, Week in My Curls, but have you seen Week in My Waves? Week in My Waves. Currently, I'm looking like a scarecrow, so you might be asking, why would I be taking hair advice from you? That's a great question. <laughs> Biggest of thank yous to Suave for sponsoring today's video. I'm so excited to show you how to make these affordable, sulfate-free products work for your waves. By the way, friends, I have no face makeup on. Like, I have chapstick and I have blush on. Nothing is on my skin and, like... <laughs> We've come a long way. Comment down below if you want an update on my Accutane journeys, but let's go ahead and hop into the shower on this day one hair. We are jumping in with Suave's Luscious Curls Shampoo. This curl shampoo and conditioner system is formulated with amino acid complex, which works to smooth hair by working from the inside of the hair fiber. Moving on to the conditioner. This is a nice lighter weight conditioner. It, it, this, this combination of shampoo and conditioner really allowed me to have fantastic volume all week long. I'd say even more than I normally get. So if you struggle with volume, I think this is a really, really nice combination to try. We are fresh out the shower, plus 10 or 15 minutes because I took a quick chips and salsa break and I put on a little bit of foundation and blush. Okay, so um, my hair is predominant, it's, it's pretty pretty wet. Um, we might add a little bit more water to make it soaking, soaking wet so that we can start our day one hair super, super defined. For our styler today, we're jumping in with Suave's Air Dry Cream. You guys know I love cream products. Cream is always, always my go-to styler. I do like to follow it up with a gel to be sure that it's going to last me all week long. I find air dry creams in general have a slightly more like tousled, beachy, wavy look with a little bit less definition. So I'm gonna apply just slightly more than I typically would to get a little bit more definition to start our week off right. I'm just gonna run the cream in my hands and then I'm going to evenly disperse it throughout my hair by really breaking it in all throughout. After applying the air dry cream, I'm gonna simply scrunch out any excess water before applying our gel. Um, and I did just wanna mention the smell of these products. I know it's really important to a lot of you guys. This does have a perfume scent, but it's very light in my personal opinion because I don't like an overpowering scent, but it's, it's really good. And by the way, sorry for my like water stains. Um, <laughs> it's, I don't even know how to pinpoint it. I wish I knew. I'm really bad with smells. It just smells good. What is that magic mystery moon dust? I don't know. I can't quite place my finger on what the scent is, but it's pure magic. And actually my husband complimented me uh, when I tried these products out a couple weeks ago and like on the smell of my hair and he literally never compliments me on the smell of my hair. So if that doesn't say something, I don't know what does. Um, okay, so jumping in with a gel. Um, this line in particular from Suave unfortunately doesn't have a gel. Suave, please come out with a gel. Um, so just jump in with whatever gel you have, but I do think it's very important if you want for your waves, curls, or coils to last for an extended period of time, you've got to lock in that moisture sister. And don't forget the top, I always forget the top. <laughs> Our hair is primed and prepped. I'm going to go diffuse and show you the results. Day one results, I'm really happy with them. I really like that this gives me, this this suave air cream gives me like kind of like a PC, it doesn't all clump to like seven curls. It just gives a very PC like air dry look even though I diffused, I, I'm really, really happy with it. In my opinion, my hair looks really shiny and frizz free and I'm really happy with it. So, uh, I'm gonna rock and embrace my day one hair, but I'm not gonna mess with it too much because I want for the definition to stay and hold. So tomorrow we'll really kind of manipulate it. Day two hair is always my favorite hair, so <laughs> I will show you that tomorrow. Uh, I do wanna quickly show you how I maintain my hair every single night. You need a scrunchie, a silk scrunchie. I'm using a scrunchie by my girl Chloe uh, from the Curl Collective. So I simply pop my hair into my little pineapple. At this point, I will either just leave my hair like this and sleep on my silk pillowcase, uh, or I could use a bonnet, or I could use a silk scarf 
to wrap around my head, but I highly recommend Silk 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 when sleeping at night to not mess up your curls. And for me personally, pineappling my hair is key to beautiful next day results. This is gonna be a weird cut because I'm just gonna be saying goodnight and then it's gonna pop up and I'm gonna be saying good morning. <laughs> it is the next day. Um, I just finished doing my makeup, but I need to put on some lipstick and some little hoops because I feel naked without my hoops. Okay, so it's the next day. I haven't touched my hair. As you can see, I slept on it all night long. Uh, but if you use proper products to hydrate your hair and hold your definition, in my opinion, you will not have to really do much refreshing for second day hair. I'm gonna lean over, shake it out, and pop back up and show you what we're working with. Second day hair is personally my favorite day hair. I still have my definition, but I get more volume. Third day hair is even more voluminous, but it's also a little bit less defined. Um, I'm really happy with this second day hair. I think it looks really nice, super full, and and shiny and healthy, and I'm, I'm pleased with it. So I'm gonna go live my life. <laughs> Um, I've got a really exciting day planned. I'm gonna go pick up some Accutane pills. <laughs> I'm gonna take Mochi to the dog park. Are you excited? I'm gonna film an Instagram reel. I'm gonna catch up on my Bible study because I'm a little bit behind. Just a little bit. <laughs> Couple days worth. <laughs> and I'm gonna go to the grocery store. We have a riveting day ahead. And I will see you guys tomorrow for day three hair with Suave. We're on day two. We're going to day three. Good night. Good morning. It is the next day and <laughs> <laughs> Clearly I haven't touched my hair yet. Um, I haven't even had coffee. So um, I got pretty frustrated with my hair last night and I ended up clipping my ends down because they kept like getting all over my face and I'm always terrified that the like, you know, the creams in my hair will get on my skin and then cause me to break out. So I ended up cl clipping up the ends. If you cannot do that, that's better, but I'm gonna show you how to refresh it regardless. First things first, we wanna just shake it out. That's how I always start to see what I'm working with. And I basically fluff from underneath. Then I kind of finagle it to see See where we're at. Third day hair, I do like to dive in with the dry shampoo. This is the Hair Refresher Dry Shampoo from Suave. Um, and it absorbs the oil because I can feel in the back, especially if my hair is really flat and it feels a little, a little gracey. So I like to section the hair. Boom, section. Ooh, and it smells really good too. Section. It smells just like the shampoo and conditioner and like the rest of the pink line. Section. Okay, then I'm just gonna fluff and scrunch from underneath. I told you guys, my hair gets more and more voluminous every day post wash and then consequently less defined, but that's okay. I really like this look. So what I'm gonna do is pop a little bit of the Suave Luscious Curls Cream. This is a little bit more of like a watery jelly consistency compared to the air dry cream is more of a cream whereas this defining cream is a little bit more serum -y feeling and I'm just gonna kind of like go over the top and all the pieces that might have a little frizz just kind of like coat the hair and get a little bit of that shine that we're looking for back I'm personally really pleased with how this third day hair looks. If it isn't maybe looking its best or something, I like to do a half up, half down situation on third or fourth, fifth day hair. Um, I'll just show you really quickly. I leave out the face framing pieces and then I pull my hair up with like a skinny hair tie. And I kind of just like play with it and manipulate it until I get it how I like it. And then you guys know the drill. I like to take a clip that's similar to my hair color and blends in and I pop it underneath of my high piece to keep it high and lifted throughout the day. I personally think it's really cute. It's just like kind of like cute, messy. Like I'll take the dog to the dog park, go to the grocery store, you know, live my life. Um, I don't know, hang out with friends, go out to dinner. I, I love my hair like this, I think it's really fun. It's just like kind of like messy and PC and easy. Um, I'm gonna go have some coffee and uh, I'll see you for day four. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I believe it's day four. Today is Thursday, so yes, it has to be day four. I am losing track. Okay, so fourth day hair. 
let's see what we're working with. When it comes to day four hair, we're getting, <laughs> we're getting max volume, right? But we're also getting some stretched out pieces where like it's looking straight around the face because it's been pulled up for so many times up in my little pineapple and like all that jazz. But we're gonna work some magic. So what I like to do on fourth day hair and beyond is refresh okay so I'm gonna take a water spray bottle this is a continuous spray water bottle they're incredible and I'm gonna wet down uh, my hair you do not want your hair soaking wet because if you're gonna waste that much time you might as well just wash rewash your hair you know what I'm saying um, so just like get it damp like barely damp and once again, I kind of focus on the areas that really need some extra encouragement. When we add water to our hair, we essentially kind of reactivate our product stylers. Now, if you feel like you need a little bit more hold in your hair, I do recommend going in with a little bit of a styler, but you're not gonna need nearly as much as you did the first time. So I am gonna use a little tiny bit of the Suave Air Dry Cream, and I'm just gonna scrunch and kind of like work that into the areas that really need a little extra help, a little extra TLC. And then we're just gonna scrunch to really help encourage that definition and curl pattern on both sides. This refresh, by the way, should literally only take 15 minutes. Like this, this should be a five minute, like water down, add your cream, scrunch it up, and then a five, 10 minute diffuse. So this is not, this is not like a long complicated thing here. It really doesn't have to be. Mochi loves this diffuser so much. I don't know if you can hear him. This is the one that I blow dry him with. It's the Dyson and he's obsessed with it and he really wants me to blow dry him. Anywho, okay, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and just diffuse and show you our fourth day results. And we're back. As you can see, I was able to get this piece that was just literally straight here, get some of that like definition and S-shape pattern back. Um, I've still got some really nice little curls throughout. I've got a little bit of top frizz, like a little halo frizz, but like it's okay, you know? I <laughs> I live in hot Atlanta, Atlanta, Georgia, where the players play, and y'all, I mean, I've got my doors open all the time. It's a summertime here already. It's like 75 degrees and very humid always. So, I mean, fourth day hair. She's cute. She's cute. Okay. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Good night. Ladies and gents, it is fifth day hair. Your girl just woke up. My pineapple fell out of my hair, which is awesome. So, um, and when I say pineapple, I mean scrunchy. The scrunchy fell out of my hair, thus there was no pineapple in my hair. Anywho, um, we've got some flatness today because it wasn't up all night. So I'm gonna hop in with the Suave Hair Refresher Dry Shampoo, do my method where I section it. Then we're gonna fluff. We've got our volume sister. I'm gonna use the uh, curl cream. This is the Luscious Curls Defining Cream. And I'm basically just gonna go over the edges of my hair. So I didn't mention last night, I went to a rooftop in downtown Atlanta. It was V Windy. And so um, <laughs> my hair definitely got very like frizzy and just kind of like messy. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more of this cream to kind of help with any flyaway ways and show you what we're working with. This is our day five hair. So let's do a little comparison from day one to day five. I've said this before and I'll say it again. The way you apply your products, the products that you use, and then your overnight styling methods are key to having a full, incredible wash week. And I think I mentioned this at the beginning of the video that like, no, my hair doesn't look exactly like it did day one, but I like that. I like that day one I was rocking my defined situation and then day five I've just kind of got like my messy beachy waves and like I love it. It makes me feel beautiful. <laughs> this is actually how I'm gonna go to the dog park today. I have been rocking these cute little bottom face buns um, when I'm just like going out and about on the town and uh, like when I'm going to the dog park, when I'm going on a hike, whatever. I don't know. It's cute. Like I leave some little curly tendrils out and like I think it's pretty and like Young and fun, okay? <laughs> I really
really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And thank you to SWA for sponsoring today's video. Let me know if you guys have any tips or recommendations for maintaining your waves and curls for an entire week. Drop your favorite refresh products below, and until next time, I'll see you soon. Bye, y'all.